So next up is the really spectacular the Tour and C 2016. This is our right bank for those style of wine. Um, it's made to reflect the coldest vineyards that we've got, so on the south facing slopes. So in this wine, um, it's predominantly Merlot and Cabernet Franc. Those two varieties form about 70% of the blend, and they get support from Cabernet, a little bit, Cabernet Sauvignon, a little bit of Malbec, and a little bit of Petit Verdot to just bring the whole package um, into the glass. So the wine is very aptly named the Tour and Z for a very specific reason. Um, what cools this vineyard down is first of all the aspect, but also the sea breeze that we get from the, from the ocean, from the false bay, about 15 kilometers away from the farm. So Z stands for Zephyrus, which in Greek mythology is the god of the west wind. So everything here was designed to be as cold as possible, and that gets reflected in this beautiful blend. So on the nose, you'll smell this really, really nice creamy, crunchy, um, really vibrant red cherries, blueberries, um, nice minerality coming through. And that's also what you're going to taste on the palate. So if you take a sip, um, spend a little bit of time with it, you get this really clean palette, um, with this really nice linear structures, and that makes it the most versatile of all our wines for pairing with food. So it does tend to go a little bit better with foods that's a little bit more rich. So if you've got this nice um, ribeye steak, if you can uh, get your hands onto some wagyu, I think that would be probably the best. Um, duck confit again goes really well with it. But it is really versatile. So if porcini mushrooms, it's going to pair absolutely perfect with that. Um, I'm just thinking off the top of my head, something like um, uh, rub curries works extremely well with that. So butter curries. Um, yeah, please do get some of that and enjoy it with this one.